What's going on everyone? Welcome to Box Attack. I'm Dom and here we have the McDonald's ad icons. I know everybody's been hyped as heck about these pops right here. And I mean, they're cool, you know, they're super nostalgic for a lot of people and they're super relevant today also. So it's kind of crazy, but yeah, people have been hyped over this, uh, especially ever since the McDonald's five pack dropped, uh, which I did get an order on. So as soon as that ships to me, I'll, I'll show you guys that. But essentially that five pack is just all five of these commons in one box. It's probably about this long. It's got a little sticker on the front and, and that's pretty much the differences there. That's the, that is the differences between these commons and that five pack exclusive box. There's actually no difference in the actual pops themselves. So if you didn't get that or you can't get a hold of one, don't panic. Uh, though if you're a sticker collector, I, you know, I can't argue with you on that. You, you want the five pack, so I get it. But regardless of that, we're gonna take a look at these pops individually and be sure to subscribe to the channel if you're new around here. Hit the notification bell if you have not yet so you can be notified when new videos like this drop in the future. So anyway, let's uh, let's go ahead and get started. All right, so first up, we got the real OG right here. This is Ronald McDonald. You can see here on the back, uh, we do have Fry Guys listed on the back here, which we do not have. And there are a ton of other uh, McDonald's pops coming out, like a ton, like all the Chicken McNuggets, and there's some Target exclusives that are coming out. There's much more than just this, and I think they're going to milk this for all they can. So, let's pop open Ronald here and take a look at him. This is kind of exciting, like, uh, it, it's pretty cool. I, I dig it. Look at Ronald, though. That is, that is definitely Ronald McDonald, and he is, his head, his hair is kind of like, trans it's not translucent but it's like i don't know it's weird to describe it almost looks like it's glow in the dark but i'm i'm pretty sure nah it, it ain't glow in the dark but anyway ronald mcdonald right here he's looking as happy as can ever kind of creepy just a little bit but super happy still and pretty cool pop i mean come on mcdonald's pops the only thing that we need now are mario pops like Give us Nintendo Pops, please. I noticed that he does have a little bit of trouble standing. There you go. Just needed a little bend in his in his knees to get him standing upright. Anyway, let's uh, let's move on to uh, to the next ones. All right, next up we have Mayor McCheese, and uh, Ronald did, didn't really want to stay standing up. His his feet are big, but they're big in the wrong direction, so he just wants to like fall backwards. I don't know, maybe that's better for inbox. But anyway, we have Mayor McCheese. Back of the box is the same. Of course, as we know, these are ad icons. I love the M on the top of the box. It looks pretty cool. Uh, number 88 right here. And uh, well, you know, instead of talking about it, let's open it up, check out Mr. Mayor McCheese. Yeah, there are a lot more pops that, that they can do though as far as uh, McDonald's is concerned. Look at him, look at him looking all snazzy with the sash with the M on it, cheese hanging out of his mouth. <laughs> it looks so stupid, his dumb little face. <laughs> and of course he has a little glasses in the back right here and a nose. What kind of burger do you know has a nose and eyebrows? I, I, I guess what kind of burger do you know has eyes and a body also. But besides the point, Mayor McCheese here looking super snazzy with his long coat and his striped pants sash. He's looking stylish though, I might say. Look at that. Little burger mouth. <laughs> these are so funny and these are totally taking me back to my childhood. I used to be creeped out by some of these uh, when I was a kid. Um, but yeah, so here we have Ronald next to Mayor McCheese and they're all about the same height. Uh, Mayor McCheese has a slight advantage with his little top hat that he has going on right there. But let's see if he'll stand up by himself. Okay, he's good. It's just Ronald that wants to be a problem. And there's no insert in the back of these. It would've been cool if they had like a red insert or something, just my opinion. But let's go ahead and move on to uh, the next three. Coming up next, we got Hamburglar. This dude is the OG. Uh, well, they're all kind of the OG because they're, <laughs> they are old school McDonald's. I don't even need the butter knife for this one. He's just coming right out of the box, super easy. I wonder though, I didn't look, is there any sort of secret message in here? No, there's not. That would have been cool. You guys remember, I mean, how many of you went to McDonald's and went to the play place as a kid and like, 
seeing all these characters. I have some of the older McDonald's toys up there. It might be kind of hard to see, but uh, here we have Hamburglar right next to Mayor McCheese for scale. He is a little bit shorter, as you can see. Hamburglar looking pretty, pretty cute there with his polka dot tie, his cape, and his big, big hat. This is like spy versus spy kind of hat, you know? And he's got his obvious his little face mask on and his, <laughs> his two little teeth right there. Just two little, two little teeth. He is pretty cool though. I mean, all of these McDonald's pops, I'm just, I, I can't say it enough. I'm a big fan of them simply because it's McDonald's, right? I don't even eat McDonald's at all. But as a kid, this is just like, this was all, all I was about as a kid were these characters. And uh, apparently the hype is very real for these McDonald's pops because everybody else seems to be just gobbling these up, eating them up. No pun intended, well, maybe a little pun intended. But <laughs> this is Hamburglar right here. Uh, and he stands up just fine. Again, seems like only Ronald was the one having trouble standing up. But uh, instead of forcing this in the box, I'm just gonna move on to the next one. Up next here, we have Officer Mac. And this is number 89. Of course, same stuff on the back. The boxes and everything are all the same on all these, except for the glams and stuff like that. Officer Mac, though, he is a Big Mac, if you didn't know by the name. Uh, so we have Mayor McCheese, Cheeseburger, Officer Mac, Big Mac. Um, and you can tell, look at that. He's got like uh, like a little pickle sticking out the side of his head right here. And anything else? No, he's just got, that's so random. Like, okay, we have like everything right here and like, you know, a couple of things hanging out. And then we have one little like pickle hanging out and Ronald just took a, took a spill. Definitely, uh, double-sided tape on him if yours is falling over like that. Anyway, I thought that was very random though. Just little tiny pickle hanging out the back. So we have Officer Mac, and he has a little McDonald's belt buckle right here. And he has a little uh, little star badge up there at the top. And then he has some uh, bigger boots. Did you guys ever have these guys like walking around in costumes? I've seen, I swear to God, I was a kid. I saw th some of these characters walking around in costume at McDonald's. Uh, anyway, <laughs> hands behind his back, and he's got the uh, the sesame seed bun right here up on the top, and a little McDonald's police hat as well. Pretty cool. Here, there's there's the two burger heads right next to each other, Mayor McCheese and Officer Mac. Officer Mac, though, I think is pretty cool. Out of, so far, though, so far out of all these, my favorite is is Mayor McCheese for sure, but. That, I, that's so far. We, we have one more pop to get to. And that is Big Purple right here. Grimace, Big Purple, my boy. Flocked Grimace coming soon. Mark my words on that. They will do a Flocked Grimace. I don't know, maybe it'll be a New York Comic Con thing. I, I don't know. Um, or some other Target exclusive. Uh, there's Grimace though on the side of the box and on the front. Let's take him out. Grimace is definitely getting flocked. I promise you that. Uh, I don't know if there's really anything they should have made, or maybe they will. One of these, a scented pop, maybe? I don't know, a burger, maybe something scented like a burger. That's a possibility. Here's here's Big Purp, though, right here. Big Purple, and they should definitely make this flocked. Undoubtedly, they will. Like, you already know that that's coming. I think Grimace is my favorite, though, out of all of them, um, simply because he's just, I, I don't know, I've always loved Grimace. Like, he's freaking cool. These two are like the main characters right here. Um, and come on, Ronald, just stand up for me a little bit. Okay. Uh, yeah, so I mean, <laughs> Grimace, not much really to discuss here. And he doesn't even have a head that moves. It's just kind of one piece. His legs don't move, his hands don't move. He's simple, but I like him because he's Grimace. And how can you not like him? So, Ronald, somebody tell this guy what's going on. Um, we have <laughs> these three right here. We have Officer Mac, Grimace, and Ronald. Let's see if I can get the, the other two in this hand, and I can show you all of them side by side. There we go. There are the McDonald's ad icons, at least the ones so far. Uh, you know, like I said, you know that we're getting, we're getting more. I mean, we already know that for a fact, but Ronald McDonald, a little quick spin around. We do have, not standing up, we have Mayor McCheese. Pretty cool. I love how the cheese is drooping off the sides of his head. And I am just full of mistakes today. Uh, we have Hamburglar. 
<laughs> this kid is awesome. Officer Mac, of course. A little policeman. Double decker with the tiny pickle hanging out the side of his head. And my personal favorite, Grimace. Good old Grimace. Grimace is my favorite. I don't know. I think that they're all pretty cool though. I'm happy that we have them. Uh, fingers crossed for Mario Pop someday. That'd be awesome too. But I don't know, which one of these is your favorite? Like, what are you picking up? Or have you, are you picking up the whole set? Are you gonna collect this entire McDonald's line? Like, it's not even, I feel like this line could be so big, they could just make it a line itself. Like, Pop McDonald's instead of Pop Ad Icons. Because there are just so many of them that it's, it's gonna get out of hand for you ad, ad icon collectors. I'm glad that I am not in that camp anymore. Um, but uh, yeah, Ronald, Grimace, Hamburglar, Officer Mac, uh, I Mayor, <laughs> I'm just, I'm kind of excited about this. So um, I don't know, let me know. Whoa, which one is your favorite? Down in the comment section below. And if you enjoyed this video, be sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the thumbs up button and the notification bell so you can be notified when new videos like this drop in the near future. Let me know your thoughts down in the comments section below and a big shout out to everybody over on Patreon, part of the Box Attack Army. I send them pops out of my collection every single month, so if you wanna join up with that, link is down below as well, as well as a link to the Box Attack Universe Facebook group, so check all those things out. I really do appreciate all the support, everyone. Thank you so much. Once again, this has been Box Attack. I'm Dom, and we'll catch you later.